Hey, Paul Sackett's Good News Planet. I'm here with Henny Morales. Hey, Henny, how are you? How are you, Paul? All uh, right, good. Well, I'm not really a super good because, see, there was this movie that was premiering or even uh, had been out there for a bit uh, last night, and I was unable to get it because I was at the Viennese uh, Ball. Uh, and I believe you had something to do with that movie. What was the name of that movie and uh, what, what was happening? Well, the name of the movie, we did actually a private screening uh, yesterday, and it's called Zentastic. And it is a romantic comedy uh, with a science fiction-esque element to it. You know? Romantic comedy with science uh, is it? Uh, yes. something. Uh, uh, science fiction right. You got it. All right. So we're here at Ari Veda, a good buddy of mine, Telak Malik's uh, restaurant, and uh, uh, another filmmaker. And I guess I'm a filmmaker. And we like filmmakers that make films. And give us a general idea of what the film is about. Well, this is a, um, a story about uh, uh, Spencer. Now, all of our movies, I must say, uh, are, a se are in a series. So this is one of a series of movies, and there are 20 or 21 of them in the series right now, uh, 11 of which have been finished. But in this, in this installment of the series, Spencer, which is a character based on yours truly, uh, has a new girlfriend, and she is too good to be true. She seems to be like the perfect, perfect woman. In fact, she's so perfect that all the, all the main characters Spencer can do is uh, look for flaws in her uh, demeanor, which is she's got very strange habits. Very strange habits. I would have known that. I might have left the Viennese ball early. <laughs> Was so, she there? <laughs> uh, she wasn't at this one. She'll be at the, at the next one. Oh, then. And, yes. Yeah, so Count me in. Her name is Zen, and she has uh, strange habits, and he is coming to the conclusion that she is an extraterrestrial. Oh, so, yeah. She's a who? Extraterrestrial. She's not from this planet. Because she's, she's too perfect, and she's got all these strange habits. Yeah. Does she fly? <laughs> Uh, no, she doesn't fly. Does she fly mentally? Um, she's very grounded. She's very spiritual. She's actually a very conscious person, and uh, I aspire to be at that level of, of, of consciousness. And sometimes those people are misunderstood. They're, it seems like they're too good to be true, or they're uh, they're too uh, centered, too grounded. People who are not at that level yet don't understand. And Spencer is not at that level yet of uh, where she is. That's the. Uh, the word Zen. Yes, her name. Her name is Zen. X E N, uh, and uh, Zen says, says for Zenyatta, uh, short for Zenyatta. Yes, that's her name in the movie. So uh, Zen is the spiritual name of unto itself. Yes, yes, it is. Yeah. So this is all working out. Yes, it's all working. Out. Is, uh, is it a full feature or? It what is, is a. It's a, a long short. It's, it's a forty-minute short. Okay. So, and it's, it was originally designed as its own film, but also that could behave as a pilot for a TV for a series. So 40 minutes was the length that we chose to, uh, in case you want to develop into a series. And well, in case you did want to uh, develop it into a series, what would be the next episode? Well, in this episode, uh, we establish the, uh, the, the the strangeness of Zen, and then there are some things that happen. We don't want to give away, obviously, that happen that cause them to fall deeper in love. And he becomes more enlightened, and she becomes a hero of the movie, which you can predict in the beginning. The next episode would be how they met, how Zen and Spencer met. Again, more romantic comedy, and all of these stories come from actual experience. I, I've been single a long time, so I formerly married and then four kids and all that stuff. But I've been single a long time, so I've dated a few a beautiful women, and so they're, they're, they're stories from my from my experiences with these amazing women. And it would be how they met, and I would use a couple of examples. All right. <laughs> okay, we're gonna we're gonna put a link. I mean, is this movie out in the theaters? Or where is it gonna is, go? What's it gonna? This is, this is a, uh, is now on a festival circuit. We are submitting to several festivals, uh, so you can see it uh, at festivals. And uh, with all good uh, fortune and expectation, it'll be available for view in 2022. Well, congratulations! Sounds Thank you. sounds mar marvelous. Thank you. Let me ask one last question. Sure. And uh, you know we'll have some text here so people can read up a little more sure. how to get it back to reach you and the sure. websites and things. Well, do you have a website for the movie or yes. a website for uh, the company? We have a website for our movie series, which is DirtMerchantsFilms.com, and you can see all the trailers there and all the movies that are in development, some that are released, and they're all there.
All righty, all righty. We're involved with World Peace, International Day of Peace. We do a concert, Times Square, and Central Park. We've been doing that for 20 plus. So uh, I ask many people, Henning, what is peace for you? Uh, I, I think it starts with inner peace, being being uh, being peaceful uh, as a, as a person versus uh, trying to maybe fix something else. I think we should be at peace with ourselves, conscious with ourselves, and then we spread that, and that's the best way to help. Beautiful, love it. Thank you, my friend. You're welcome. Thank you for it.